everybody and welcome to another night of the Zelda Nerds Wishlist. This time we're going into the kitchen. I'm really excited about this one because this is the one that I kind of wanted the most. This is the unofficial Legend of Zelda cookbook. Now there were plenty of Zelda inspired cookbooks out there on the internet. Maybe like three or four on Amazon alone. But this one kind of stuck out to me the most because it has a wonderful detailed hardcover to it. But also, if you look at the back, you can see there are cosplayers on it. I mean, talk about going the extra mile. And, like I said, the other cookbooks that I saw on Amazon, mm, I don't want to bash anybody, but there was a couple that didn't really even have pictures in them. And this one, you know, let's just go to a random page, right? Right here, it's a Breath of Wild inspired recipe, the Tabantha apple pie. And it has very detailed instructions how to do it, the ingredients, a little backstory on the dish itself. But then you turn the page, and there you go. A nice detailed picture of it. And guess what? It looks like it's set in the world of Breath of Wild. Now, this is a beautiful passion product made by a man, Mr. Villanova. I believe I pronounced that correctly, please don't kill me if I didn't. This is incredible. Basically, he came up with a character in Breath of Wild called the Gourmet, and it's basically like the, the travels of this character, going around Hyrule, finding out like different dishes and different ingredients, and it's pretty cool because he literally cosplays. He gets characters, like friends of his, to cosplay characters from the game. Like, look, let's see, let's see real quick. Like, look at this. We have a Princess Zelda cosplayer holding up the creamy heart soup. Like, that's incredible. And there's plenty more in there. There are so many great recipes in here, and honestly, I'm really looking forward to actually using this in real life. I'm just gonna have this displayed on my shelf. Oh no, I'm actually going to use it and cook really, really delicious looking food. I mean, incredible, incredible craftsmanship. It was a little pricey. I believe I paid about 35 bucks for it. Not terrible, but like I said, the link is going to be in the description. Please go check this guy out. I mean, good lord, you can tell how much passion and love he put into this. And again, it only has one review on Amazon. Well, soon to be two. I'm about to put in my review right now. Please, please go check this guy out. This is an incredible book and an amazing gift for any Zelda fan or hell even video game fan in general so I hope you guys do go check this out like I said if you buy it you won't regret it he didn't pay me to say that by the way I'll see you guys tomorrow night